Liftoff of the Delta rocket carrying GLAST, a gamma ray telescope searching for unseen physics in the stars of the galaxies. Ten. Let's go for main engine start. Six, five, four, three, two, one. And booster ignition and liftoff of Space Shuttle Discovery, taking the space station to full power for full science. This is Mission Control Houston. Discovery roll program. Roger roll, Discovery. Discovery's roll maneuver is complete. It is now in a heads-down position on track for its flight to the International Space Station. Discovery flying 365 miles per hour, one and a half, one and a half miles in altitude, seven miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center. Discovery's engines are throttling down as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum pressure on the vehicle. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And ignition and liftoff of Ares 1X. Testing concepts for the future of new rocket design. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis on a mission to build, resupply, and to do research on the International Space Station. Houston now controlling. Atlantis begins its penultimate journey to shore up the International Space Station. Atlantis now on the proper alignment for its eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Four and a half million pounds of hardware and humans taking aim on the international outpost. 30 seconds into the flight. Atlantis almost two miles in altitude, almost six miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center already, traveling 500 miles an hour. The three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back to 72% of rated performance going into the bucket, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it breaks through the sound barrier. Atlantis now beginning what is known as the Pre-flare maneuver, it will pull the nose up a little bit right before it uh, hits the runway. Its speed now 320 miles per hour. The gear is down and locked. Main gear touchdown. Atlantis' nose being now rotated down toward the runway. The uh, chute being deployed. And nose gear touchdown. Space Shuttle Atlantis now comes home to the Kennedy Space Center for the final time in 25 years. 32 flights and more than 120 million miles traveled. The legacy of Atlantis now in the history books.